Ever feel like you're seeing the same game twice? I mean, again and again. From Tomb Raider to Horizon Zero Dawn, video game remasters are everywhere. But are they worth your time or just a cash grab? Let's dive into what a remaster really is and why they keep coming out. So what exactly is a video game remaster? Simply put, it's an updated version of a game we already know with better graphics, sound, and sometimes gameplay tweaks. Think of it as giving an old game a fresh coat of paint so it runs smoother on modern consoles. They improve things like textures, lightning, and sound, and sometimes adjust controls to fit what today's players expect. Remasters let new gamers experience classic titles while giving longtime fans a chance to relieve the nostalgia, just in higher resolution. Don't confuse remaster with a remake. Remasters polish what's already there, but a remake? That's a full rebuild. They change everything, from graphics to gameplay and sometimes even the story. For example, Tomb Raider Anniversary was a complete overhaul of the original Tomb Raider. They redesigned the game from ground up, adding modern gameplay and new story elements. Sometimes the line between remaster and remake can be a bit blurry. Some games get ported to new engines and get massive changes, while others just look prettier, but generally remasters stick closer to the original game. Now let's talk about the game that recently stirred up a ton of debate in the gaming world. Until Dawn. Fans can't seem to agree on whether it's a remake or just a remaster, and the Reddit threads are on fire about it. On one side, some gamers argue it's definitely a remake. It's a remake. The whole game is rebuilt in new engine with added content and recompose soundtrack. So that's way more than just a visual upgrade. But others like this Redditor think it's more complicated than that. They say it falls into a gray area between remaster and a remake. Sure, there's a new third person camera mode and updated music, but at its core, it's still the same game. They call it more of a reimagining than a full-blown remake. Some users point out that neither remake or remaster is used in the official marketing, which adds to the confusion. So what's the verdict? In the case of Until Dawn, it's not as simple as saying remake or remaster. The truth lies somewhere in between with enough changes to make it feel fresh, but not quite a complete overhaul. What do you think? Are we splitting hairs here or is there a big difference? Let us know in the comments. Here's the big question. Why do remasters keep getting made? The answer is simple. It's cheaper, faster, and safer than making new games from scratch. With remasters, the story, gameplay, and characters are already there. The developers just have to update the visuals and sound and bam, you've got a new release. It also requires a smaller team and much smaller budget compared to developing a brand new title. And let's be real, nostalgia sells. Even if new players aren't interested, older fans will still buy the game to relive their favorite memories. Some people think remasters are just a lazy cash grab, and honestly, I get it. Take Horizon Zero Dawn, for example. That game came out in 2017 and it still looks incredible on modern systems. So why remaster it already? There hasn't been a huge technological leap since its release. Do we really need a remaster of something that still looks and plays great? So, are video game remasters worth it? Honestly, it depends on the game. Some definitely deserve a remaster to bring them back to life on modern consoles. Others, though, not so much. But what do you think? Are remasters a good way to keep gaming history alive or are they just cash grabs? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button, subscribe for more things gaming. And don't forget to share this with your fellow gamers. Let's keep the conversation going.